The night team's Mark Lovica joins us live from where police discovered his body. Mark. Yeah, Eric and Sarah, we have learned within the last 10 minutes or so that police have positively identified the body as James Smith. He has been missing for the last 24 hours. The search area was extensive, covering many, many miles, but it was a reverse 911 call that led police here. 22,000 residents on Madison's east side got that phone call, a recorded message. A resident then checked the back of his property after receiving that message and then discovered Smith's body. I spoke with Smith's family earlier this afternoon. They told me they were extremely worried about James's well-being. His aunt say he suffers from seizures and they worried that he would not survive without his medication. That's why they were hoping for the best in the search for him. Again, James went missing on Sunday night. He does have severe cognitive disabilities. He also left without a coat and his family says with the overnight cold temperatures, that is what was concerning them as well. Police have not released a cause of death. They do tell us that they do not believe foul play was involved. The body was discovered along this tree line you see behind me about a quarter mile in. Again, it's about less than two miles from James home when he went missing on Sunday night. We will continue to follow this story when police release more details on the exact cause of his death. We have, of course, will share that. Very sad story tonight. Mark Lovick, reporting from Madison's east side. Mark, thank you.